We'll get the Kleenex ready for Tim. Sandra, go ahead. I have in my hand a very small handmade bear. Uh, now this little bear was donated to us and one of my volunteers came across it when they were sorting through the toys a couple of days ago. It's a little green, he's, he's green, he's made of felt and he has Jesus all over him. He has a little pocket at the back and when we looked a bit closer at this little bear there was a little note tucked in the pocket. Now this note reads, Dear Child, I hope you will enjoy this special toy bear. Love Grace and Colin and Princess. Well, we were all in pieces as soon as we read that because, you know, this in itself just speaks volumes of exactly what Christmas is all about. That's right. Of just giving. And I really what Marathon's all about, I'm like tearing up yeah. hearing the story again for the second time, but... Um, I think it was Joni who had told us the story too about what the donations to the Salvation Army meant to her and her family. And it really is about people giving just what they can, any little thing, even a little handmade item like this bear, to help people enjoy the spirit of the season and the holidays, to enjoy Christmas, to enjoy spending time with their family. So um, even a small gift can mean such a, a large portion of somebody's life can make a difference. Yeah, I don't think I've ever seen as many people crying <laughs> at the same time as I did when this was found. You're going to do this all day and oh, tomorrow, yeah, right? Yes, every, every <laughs> guest. Now back to our host, live on location. And I'm Tim Davidson down at the uh, Standard Insurance on 2nd Street South with the 25th Miracle Marathon. And uh, joining me, we have on the couch, Jeff Strachan. And I was going to, do we call it CJBN, CJTV? You can call it CJBN. We don't use CJTV anymore. Uh, uh, also representing Shaw TV on Channel 10. CJBN is on Channel 12 for those who get confused about it. And, of course, our parent company, Shaw Cable. Okay, now uh, we've got uh, kindly the camera set up here, taking a picture of uh, us, and uh, so this is going to be running at what time? So uh, I know when well, to we're going to we're, we're put <laughs> <laughs> we'll put this up on our Facebook page. Okay, cool. So, uh, what brings uh, CJBN in today? Uh, well, actually, Kim Morrison usually comes down here, spends time with you, and tells stories. And uh, this year, Kim is out of town, so at the last minute, she said, "You do it." <laughs> <laughs> so you draw straws and. Yeah. Well, no, basically, Kim just <laughs> assigns things okay, like that. That's good. So, uh, does uh, CJ, uh, I'm say CJBN, sure. does it do anything special uh, around the Christmas time, get ready for that kind of thing? Uh, this year, uh, CJBN is, or Shaw, I should say, is putting on the Winnipeg Christmas Parade and uh, sponsoring the Great Cup. Uh, so, a lot of effort has been put into that, especially in Winnipeg. And here, we uh, traditionally collect foodstuffs and uh, and donations for the Salvation Army in, in the office here. Oh, okay, so uh, did you drop off some stuff that uh, we can talk about? Uh, I will. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you haven't got there yet. I haven't. I, I don't have uh, anything with me, but I do have a check. Okay, perfect. Uh, Sandra's collecting over there, and she said that last word we had $4,900 in cash. Is that somewhere around uh, correct? Um, 4913 How much? Forty-nine thirteen. Forty-nine thirteen plus some Canadian tire cash. I saw put in there. <laughs> yeah, I, I last minute of his home at lunch, and I cleaned out my drawer of all the Canadian tire money that gets shoved into drawers. I figured <laughs> I'm never going to use it, but you can. It's worthwhile, and we'll buy something, especially at the, this time of year. And uh, so you say you you have Shaw crews doing uh, parades in Winnipeg, but what about Kenora? Are you down there uh, tomorrow as well? Uh, tomorrow, Shelley and Matt, uh, Shelley Bougel, Matt Kennedy, will be down at the parade, and they'll be uh, recording that, and we'll put that up on Shaw TV Channel 10. Oh. Now, it's a little-known uh, fact that Matt Kennedy was a former announcer at the radio station as well. Yes, 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 <laughs> yes. And he's a film producer as well. That's true. So... Uh, He's uh, well known around the community, I'm sure, and uh, a good uh, videographer. Yes, and a long time resident. Yeah, exactly. Okay, well, and uh, thanks for coming down, and uh, we can expect a donation from CJBN at some point? Yes. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> See, it's easy, isn't it, being in front of the camera? Oh, yeah. I have been in front of the camera. Usually I'm on the other side. Yeah, it's uh, usually see, and then say, uh, uh, Kim's usually the 
the talent, right? Kim's in front, yeah. 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 Kim, Kim has a better face for, for TV. Yeah. It's funny that they, they call people in front of the camera the talent and people who behind uh, who are untalented. Uh, uh, it doesn't make I, uh, no, sense. No, it's just behind the camera. Behind the camera, right. <laughs> well, thanks for joining us today and uh, your contributions to the community. And uh, we look forward to uh, some coverage of the uh, parade tomorrow and uh, the rest of the way. Yeah, the uh, parade, once we get post-production, because it'll be two different cameras, uh, will probably be up on Sunday. Oh, okay, good. And uh, that'll, be, that'll be on the, the Cable 10 uh, that'll be channel. That'll be on Cable Channel 10, and we'll put it on uh, the Shaw TV Facebook page as well. Okay, perfect. Thanks for joining us today. It's Jeff Strachan and uh, part of the uh, Christmas Miracle Marathon down here at uh, the Standard. We're going to take a, another break, as I mentioned, coming up at 2 o'clock. We've got a couple of school groups coming in with, uh, I believe, some large donations. They're doing some fundraising, so we'll have uh, details from them coming up a little later on. Right now, we'll go to some more music or a break, uh, whatever's coming up.